what's up guys welcome back once again it is me Molt. so happy to be here with you guys as always and as you can see from the title of the video guys we are on our second video of classing <laughs> clashing culture I had such an awesome response to that first video with wrecking ball Valkyrie um, I couldn't believe it I wasn't sure how y'all would respond I'm so happy that y'all like it because I love doing this kind of stuff uh, Photoshop is a lot of fun to play around with um, and today I went through all the comments uh, and I found out which one I'm going to do next. Make sure that you guys like this video um, and comment below what you want me to do uh, in the next video because this is fun for me. Like I said, I'm going to keep doing it um, and the in the description below you'll be able to download the pictures if you want. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. But today we are going to be uh, doing a picture right here. You can see uh, this picture of Barack Obama and his family. Uh, one of the biggest requests for me to do was a hog rider on Barack Obama. So here we go. We have a max level hog rider and we are going to put his head on <laughs> Barack Obama. I didn't know that Obama had a hog rider in his family. That was pretty sweet, man. You know, I didn't think these things were real, but I don't know. I guess they are. Um, all right, so first we need to uh, seclude this head just like we did with the uh, Miley Cyrus one. And why don't we go ahead, since this is just white in the back, <clears throat> um, we can just select. I'm going to pump this up to 25. Somebody in the last thing said, why do you use the magic wand? You're a noob. And... I don't know, because it's, yes, I know how to use the pen tool, but nothing's wrong with the magic wand either. That's why it's in Photoshop. <laughs> um, so we're going to select this, and we are going to go and modify our selection by, yes, contracting it. Um, and we are going to fill that with black as well. There we go, looking pretty good. All right, now we need to go in here with a hard brush and brush around his beard because the beard's important man <laughs> I saw this ad the other day that uh, that said that beards are ruining the the shaving industry like uh, with razors and all that kind of stuff it's kind of funny I wish I could grow a beard I mean I can grow some facial hair but man if I could grow a beard like like this guy whew, I would definitely do it because he looks freaking awesome now that I mean that's a beard if I've ever seen a beard you know what I'm saying um, I know that I could be using the pin tool on this like you guys said but I don't want to I'm just going to brush it um, there we go zoom in a little bit more I need to get all around his his head because it still has that little glow on it just going around. Uh, poor little, I don't I don't know Barack's uh, family's name or his children's name. So I don't know who this girl is. But uh, yeah, your daddy's about to turn into a Clash of Clans character. So sorry about that, right? <laughs> Nat. Alright, get rid of this. Guys, it's raining outside. I don't know if y'all can hear it. But there's a ridiculous storm going on right now. I like storms, except for... Uh, when I want to be outside. That was a horrible brush right there. Uh, Alright, so we're going to clean this up. Get rid of all this white around him. Uh, there we go. Make this a little smoother. There we go. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Their orange hair is so ridiculous. Smooth off his head. Come up around here. I might actually use the, the pen tool on his hair. Just to make it a little bit smoother. And we'll cut some of it off. Just so that it's perfect. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, guys, make sure to comment below as to what you want to see next. Because... <clears throat> Um, I wasn't. I was planning on doing these like once a week, if even that. I didn't know how you guys were gonna react, but obviously, since you guys uh, like it, then I'm going to do more of them. Right, right. 
So comment below as to what you want, and we're done. <laughs> Not really. Make this a little bit bigger. Perfect. Zoom in. You know, we might just add another character to the background just to make this a little bit more interesting. Um, <clears throat> and I know that I could use the pin tool on the beard too, but you know, beards aren't really precise. Like, beards aren't symmetrical. So there really should be some, uh, there really should be some flaws in the beard. Um, yeah, so that's why I'm not going to use that for all of you Photoshop users out there who think I don't know what I'm doing. All right. We need to put a shadow underneath him, so we're just going to grab our brush tool and go ahead and brush this down here, get it up on his shoulder, and let's put that down to like, uh, let's put it at 50%. Yeah, there we go. Erase some of it. Erase some up there. <laughs> this looks ridiculous. Scoot it down some. There we go. Oh, looks like we are going to have to uh, scoot this over to block his head. Actually, what I'm going to do is um, I want to make this one a little bit better for you guys. We're at six minutes right now. Uh, I'll try and keep it to like, I don't know, 15 or so. But <clears throat> let's go ahead. Let's go into filter and let's go liquefy some of this. Uh, let me pull this over so y'all can see what I'm doing. So what I'm going to try and do is move this whole little section over just a little bit. I'm not going to try and mess up, or I'm going to try not to mess up the shape of their head too much. Alright, there we go. So now you can see uh, that we can no longer see his head behind her. Um, or his ear, so that's good. That's exactly what we want. Um, I'm gonna work on this a little bit. I feel like his beard wouldn't come up like this, so let's bring that out some. No, there we go. Wish their earrings were a little bit better. All right, so um, his skin looks like it needs to be a little bit. Lighter, maybe? Let's see what we can do. Uh, first, we need to do that. Desaturate a little bit. There we go. Add a little bit of contrast to him. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That looks better. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> oh man alright we're going to try and add one more thing to this um, so I'm going to go into here and I am going to really really quickly uh, let's see where are you I'm going to here we go alright so I'm going to add this P.E.K.K.A. into the picture <laughs> let's put the P.E.K.K.A. back um, here in this doorway back behind everybody <laughs> yeah right back there all right so the P.E.K.K.A. is going back there uh, we need to put a mask on it and I'm gonna put it down to about 25 percent no let's put it down to 75 so that I can see behind it <clears throat> and know what I need to brush over so obviously it's gonna be behind all of them it's gonna be behind the door um, so I'm going to get rid of most of it, and then I'm going to color the rest back in. Um, sorry, i got to close out of this. Okay, so, P.E.K.K.A. 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 We want it to be standing in the doorway. So we need to go from here... Straight down to, uh, I'll use the pen tool. From here, straight down to his shoulder. Yeah. And then, let's follow his shirt down to where the P.E.K.K.A.'s feet will be. 
Yep, yep, yep. There we go. Alright, that's good. Oh, wait. I didn't notice that the chair was right there. We don't want it to come up in front of the chair. So now we're going to come out of here. Good. There we go. We're going to make that a selection. And we're going to fill that with white. Alright, so now the Pekka. The Pekka is back there in the doorway. Um, but it's too bright right now, right? Like, you, you shouldn't be able to see that much light back there. So, um, we are going to fill this with black. Uh, the peck actually needs to be at 100% now. There we go. And let's see what we can do. Whoa, that was pretty scary, huh? Yep. <laughs> that looks pretty good. Yeah, why don't we add some, I'm going to add some sort of a light source back here though, um, <clears throat> just so that you can see a little bit of the P.E.K.K.A. So we're going to make it look like there's a light back here. The rest of it's going to stay uh, black. Yeah. And then why don't we go ahead and uh, so we're going to select where the door is, fill over, right, Make selection, and then let's go ahead and add a light back here, yep, there we go, and oh, let's do this. Put it down to like 75% maybe. Alright, so now there's a light back there in the hallway with the P.E.K.K.A. lighting it up. Um, I'm actually going to put that at 50. There we go. And you know what, guys? There we have it. <laughs> Alright, so it looks like the Hog Rider is now a part of the presidential family. Um, so good job, Clash of Clans, for making it into the White House uh yeah that's it guys i hope that y'all enjoyed this one this one was fun again my whole goal in these like i can make some cartoony but i want them to look like they could possibly be real i don't know um so as you can see uh right there mr president has now been turned into a hog rider so yep i'm sorry uh miss <laughs> i'm sorry obama's wife for what i did to your husband but that is going to be it today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Leave a like if you had fun watching this. Um, comment below as to what you want me to do next. Uh, we have already done <laughs> Valkyrie Wrecking Ball, and now we have done uh, Mr. President Hog Rider. And who knows what's next? Comment below. Leave a like, guys. Subscribe if you haven't. Lots more fun to come. I appreciate the support so much. Uh, you guys rock. That's really all there is to it. And hey, make sure that you keep calm and clash on for me, right?